everyone and welcome back to another video so i've been to tesco today now it's going to be a tesco shopping haul but it's a little bit different because i got some clothing i got a bit of baby clothing as well and it's just really exciting okay i've just spent a good hour in there I decided to get to tesco today because the only thing is when you get to Lidl it's great but you don't get everything and sometimes especially the weekend you want a few little treats but you want like Cadbury's or you know what I mean like you need some good stuff so that's what we went to <clears throat> if I can clear the frog the frog in my throat that's why we went to tesco this week uh, to be fair there's no special reason we just decided to just travel out a bit spend an extra 10 minutes on the road and um, have an adventure so i've got a few little bits it's it's exciting so if you want to carry on watching then please do like the video if you haven't already you're only what 56 minutes in 56 minutes 56 seconds so yeah consider liking and i do now because on my analytics it's telling me that most of the people in fact more than half um who watch my videos aren't subscribed now it is free so you don't have to pay for it or anything like that it's just down below if you want to do it you don't have to but it's worth doing all right it's one of the first things that i am going to show this is the reason why i'm facing this way first because i want to show you some of the bits before i show you the food so it depends what what bit you want to really watch but they have these in tesco it's great them kath kidson kath kidson shopping bags but it's christmas themed how lovely is that i mean look at the pictures look at this look at these really pretty little illustrations on this bag so that's that same on the back as well red red handle and that's just 100 percent of this bag comes from recycled materials this was 175 i believe and you know what i didn't need it um, not part of my shop but i thought you know i'm gonna get it anyway because this is perfect for shopping shopping in style so yeah if you fancy one of these the 175 in tesco grab yourself one and then the next little thing that i picked up oh look at this look at this how cute is that now i did mention i don't think um you'll see that video in fact i don't know if i'm going to publish it because i do get a little bit is people going to enjoy it but i did try and film a little bit of a vlog the other day um and what i did i announced that one of our family members they've had a baby so what we did well i, I needed to anyway um just see if i can find something now it's always a little bit awkward when like someone has like a newborn there's a new baby what do you get but i'll pick this outfit up one because it was in the sale and we all love a bit of a bargain um but if you want to know how much it was it was 14 quid originally and i got it for eight quid now um, this is up to three months and i thought that's probably going to be a little bit more wiser because everyone will get all the newborn bits you know what i mean and it, 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 there's no point because it won't fit into them in a couple of weeks so what i'm going to do or what i have done is i bought this little outfit it's very autumnal and i love it because there's a t-shirt and you've got like the dungarees with it as well and that's the back how lovely is that i think that's really really nice and a good bargain for eight quid um i would have got some second hand bits but i didn't know whether that was appropriate to be honest with you probably if it was my own but i thought because it's somebody else's baby i'll just get brand new so i got that and then I just got this card. This video will go up by the time I see it. Um, but yeah, this is the, the card. Oh, lovely. Oh, that's lovely there. New baby boy. Look at that. It's it's beautiful. I say that, but it's quite Easter, right, is it? Because there's like a bunny. No, it's I. No, it's I. I don't know what I'm on about. Um, but yeah, that's really lovely. So I thought I'd show you that because, you know, there's some bargains in Tesco at the minute. And then for myself, I do if I've got food around my mouth or I look a little bit scruffy, it's because I've had my tea. So so for myself, I've picked up right this black coat. It's really long. Now I'm quite tall, I'll be honest with you. Um so this is the story behind it is I needed a coat because when I'm going to work, early hours in the morning, I might have to stand outside for a bit, you know, in the freezing cold. And, you know, just in general, you know, when you're going for walks, you know, bonfires coming up, Halloween, Christmas markets. And I think it's always just nice to have a coat. Now, I love a bit of secondhand. 
Um, but I haven't been finding anything and I've been saving some birthday money purposely for a winter couch because I normally do that. So I've been very lucky that I had some birthday money. <clears throat> Bearing in mind my birthday was like a month ago and I've kept some of it purposely because I wanted a couch. Now, you could easily just go and buy a couch and I do understand that. But let's be honest, right, let me just get into how much it was. This was £45, this couch. I mean, I think that that is expensive, but they do have a 25% off at the minute. So they might still have it on by the time I put this video out, I'm not quite sure. But there is a 25% off at the minute in Tesco. So I've got 25% off that. So I don't know, you tell me the maths because I can't do that. And I just think it's got a hood, you know, it's basic, it's plain, it's really long. So if you've got like leggings on, boots, um, and these are the, um, the cuffs, uh, I think it's just brilliant. You know, it's not to everyone's tea. But yeah, but it's just that inside. It's really, really basic. But I can just imagine my bub bubble hat, my scarf, my leggings, my boots, and like a chunk in it. I think that's going to be really nice, nice and basic. And because I'm, I'm glad I didn't spend forty five quid, because like I said, it's really expensive, and not everyone can afford that. Whether you can or not, who's watching this, it is expensive. Um, but luckily, I did save a little bit of money for for that purchase, so it didn't go in any of my budgets. So I think. Yeah, I'm really happy with that, to be honest. So I've got like a nice winter coat now for the winter. So let's get on to the uh, shopping haul, shall we? So I'm looking at everything and I'm like, this uh, this is not my best haul, I'm going to be honest. Um, but it is the weekends, so we wanted some treats and I think we've overdone ourselves because we haven't treated ourselves for a while and I think we've just gone all out. Um, but we needed some essential bits like... Um, Sherry gel, you know, I saw this and shrubbery and raspberry, you know, whatever. Uh, we needed some juice, we got some tropical juice, some cereal, rice snaps, another bit of rice snaps, me. Uh, and we just got multiple crisps. So these are like the snacky crisps for like indulgence. And then we do have like, I don't know, pack lunches. So I've just picked some of them six ridge variety pack. Um, but yeah, we've got light EC sorted. These are on club card for a quid. Um, this ties by a sweet chili, and this is um, in the world oil, the world food oil, cheese and onion grills. Um, we've got some Twixies. These are like pat lunch stuff as well, and then just naughty bits. I mean, oh, that's my shopping list. Um, I think I was meant to touch up on that actually. I did a shopping list because, like I said, I've been going off on a tangent, so I needed to do one. Um, and I've looked through the freezer and everything and I've got my meals for the week, which is good. Um, we've got some muffins, chocolate muffins, £1.80. When did muffins become that expensive? Um, anyway, so we've got a Galaxy, we've got two packets, so we're going to have like a film or something, you know. M&M's, Milky Way, Magic Stars, I haven't had these for, for years. Um, so we've got some of them. Roasted peanuts and we've got five oak oak um, oat and raisin cookies 125 unbelievable um so that is all our little weekend snacks obviously these will go into the week as well um with me around they'll be gone by tonight um so just some of the bits now this is a bit of a crazy selection here but uh me and chris i've been having a lot of soups but chris wanted to join in as well and uh, i've been taking them to work you know they're just really nice like tomato soup quite sweet it's just you know gives you that edge um so we've got two tomato two chicken two veg definitely like my favorite the chicken then the veg then the tomato um but chris picked these up and these are not my first choice what we've got scotch broth chicken and mushroom um what on earth is that i have no idea an oxtail soup so we've got a lot of these like i said it's, it's just getting colder and sometimes you don't want a salad you want some at warm so that's what that's for um fruit strawberries they're not the best date i'll be honest these are shocking but they, they, they every one of them have the 23rd on um so we've got some strawberries we've got some oranges because i have them in my packed lunches and i love a banana in the morning after my breakfast as well so these were on loose they were 73p now the green are the better for me because when i know i brought by them green i know that over the few days they are my perfect banana and um, i don't like a banana that's very yellow 
I don't, I don't understand. All bruised. I just don't get it. Um, so those are my bananas. I mean, I would have preferred a bit more green, to be honest. But, you know, we'll, we'll stick with it. Um, we've got some milk. I put it up here today. I don't know why. But, yeah, we've got some milk. I've been having some porridges. In fact, I did pick up these from Erin Foods. I'm just going to grab them out the cupboard so nothing else you know drops but i got these from heron foods these simple simply strawberry um out you know the little sachets a quid a quid for them i didn't think that was bad and i don't think they run out a day until next year is it gonna tell me because i you had to check the dates in heron foods um let's have a look yeah, so January next year. So we've got a few months to have some of them. So I'll pick them up. So yeah, so some milk. That's the reason why I showed you them. Um <clears throat> honestly I've got some right frogs in my throat. Um we've got seafood sticks, so these are like something that Chris would snack on. Not my type of thing, I'll be honest. And um, we've got two packets of them, and then we've got some cherry tomatoes. I'm going to do a bit of salad as well. Why not? You know, some soup one day, some salads. I'm just trying not to have too much bread because I used to have, like, toast, sandwiches, all in one day. It's not great. Um, so I've got been having some salads, some soups, just a bit of alternative. So that's why I've got a bit of a lettuce um and we've got a broccoli because like i said i've been looking through my fridge and freezer and i've selected only what i need um so yeah broccoli said that some salty butter um nice and then we've got some garlic bread because we've got some spaghetti in the freezer um so that's why i've got that basically so that's one meal and i've only had to spend 30 some at p for that one meal um we've got some cooked ham because i'll chop a few bits up put it in my salad so that's i think it's 199 for that full for the full that but i can't get the words out for that full pack um and then this tiny little is it new is it Oh, allergy update. Um, just this really small cold sore um, because, you know, I think it's only me that really would eat it. I don't think Chris really fancies things like this, to be honest. So I've got this. and um, There is a cheaper alternative to this, um, like their own brand. Um, I think it's the Stockwell brand. However, I just decided to give her this because it's smaller. Um, and then some bready bits. Um, we've got these because these were reduced. These Warburton's, they were... 175 but i got them for 75p so a quid off they've been really nice with maybe some scrambled egg or something um and then we've got these because we've got some sausages and we're gonna have like a sausage sandwich tomorrow being it's the weekend why not they were 80p um for some soft buns and then just these last little bits um so we've got some chips you know it's one of them it's just you shove it in the freezer worst case scenario you just chuck some of them in the air fryer if you have one or put it in the oven if you ain't um we picked up some chicken and this is going to go straight in the freezer because it was reduced i got it it was meant to be a fiver but i got it for 250 um but their other range of chicken breast was a little bit more expensive for the same weight so i thought i'll buy this frozen um reduce and i'll just fr freeze that so it's cheaper than what they've got on the shelf if that makes sense um and then we've got some chicken chicken things hot and spicy chicken steaks we've got southern fried because i'm not going to have them so we've just got some of them for the freezer and then a bag of peas that's all we've got for the freezer um but that is everything that we've got from tesco today and i really just wanted to show you because I don't know what I don't know what to say about this. To be honest, ignore ignore the washing up there. You, you look, I even that's it. You, that's all you're gonna say. Um, but that's that's everything. That's what we've got from Tesco this week. So, what do you think of the shopping haul? What do you think of me coat? You might not like it, but it is. It's not a fashion statement. It's for the cold. All right, and then the baby little outfit. What do you all think? And the calf kids and back. I mean, that's just exciting as it is. And um, then obviously the shopping because that's important. But I really need to get that away because I put the eating on and there's freezer stuff over there, so I better sort it out. And um, but nice ch catching up with you guys. It really is always is. Um, comment down below. Say hello. Say whatever you want. Really, as long as it's nice. Um, I've had some comments, not comments, but sometimes in private messages, um, and them lovely. You know, some people come over and say i love i love your videos i watch them and sometimes i do sit there thinking why am i doing this you know it, it's a very good is it you know no one likes it and then i have comments like that and it's like right 
that's why I do it that's why I continue to do it but anyway I'm, it's, it's getting too late now I need to pop this shopping away have a good one have a good rest of the week guys and I'll check you in on the next video bye <laughs>